we think that type 1 diabetes is caused primarily by T cells that traffic to the pancreas and destroy the beta cells. But what we've learned from our drug studies is one way they might work is they might help encourage a unique subpopulation of T cells called regulatory T cells or Tregs. We're hoping that this Treg cell population turns off that immune destruction of the insulin producing beta cells. One tremendously exciting thing that we've been working on here is can we identify this population of cells, purify them away, grow them up, and use them as unique cell-based therapy as a way to dampen down that immune response. Dr. Bluestone and his colleagues have been able to show in an animal model of diabetes that they can find the cell type, they can grow it up and give just a single injection of those cells and cure the mice. And we've cured a lot of mice here at UCSF over the years. The next step of this is can we do it for man? So we've just finished enrolling our first phase one study with this cell product. It's worked very, very well. And so now we're moving into larger um, phase two studies. This just looks incredibly promising in a whole novel uh, new area. This is the first time we're trying this in autoimmunity. And um, yeah, it's very exciting.